I walk into the park, yeah. all right, I want to find God, yeah. all right? I got up to and a this is I the same person who was sending juice. dick pictures See, look, to fellow you Muslim women. You're never going to get what you want in your da'wah. Is that how you do da'wah? Is that how you do da'wah? Da is that how you do da'wah? Da da Let's get Saracen next week. Keep him here. One my friend, Samuel, would you send pictures of your private yeah. parts to fellow Muslim women? You're, you're, you're made from that. You're made from this semen. It's not impure. The Bible. It's not impure. Will you go yes, to the I would. Mosque? Yes, I would. If the you, prophet did so that. So you'll come to the part with semen on your... I would. I would. I don't think it's impure. Whatever the prophet. 1 Samuel 15, 9. 15, 9. Go smite the Amalekites wherever you find them. Spare not man. Now, do you, do you have a problem with that? Infant. Do you? I'm asking you. I do. Do you? Uh, okay. Now, Please don't try this funny business of Christianity with me. Let don't me. do that. Take that Let back. Otherwise, no. I'll floor you now. You it's a big one. Now. Why do you always slander people just we because they heckle you? Like I'm doing right now. We continue. <laughs> Last time you called us extremists. Extremist one, <laughs> extremist two. Yes, or, but you are right. I am an extremist heckler. Extremist heckler. <laughs> extremist heckler. Extremist Tweedle heckler. D and he Tweedle Dum. The two, my two favorite. He's the black heckler. Last time heckler in the park. So excited when you saw Paul. <laughs> Paul. I don't need to get excited. Why don't you come on camera? Why don't you come on camera? Why don't you both come on camera? Why don't you? Come on, because why don't you both come on? If you are brave, stand in the spotlight. Come on, if you are brave, stand. Come on, stand in the in the spotlight. Come on. These these people may be the next Abu Qasim. The next Abu Qasim. You see, what was these two people said they wouldn't condemn. Abu Qasim, last week he got five years, five years, answer this question, has Bob been sentenced to five years in prison for promoting terrorism, has Bob been sentenced to prison, has Bob been convicted, do you, do you, do you agree, do you agree with Abu Qasim, do you agree with Abu Qasim, five years, do you agree Remember, no, they said they do not condemn no, Abu Qasim no, and he was given no, five no, years no, last no, week. No, you said it's not no, true. No, we'll put the video in because it's on COE. Now they're denying it. Their very own words, they're ashamed. But they said they would not condemn Abu Qasim. So, so let me ask you, who's worse? Who's worse, Bob or Abu Qasim? Europe. Is being Bob! terrorized by people. Bob! So they He's condemn Bob, but Bob! they don't condemn a convicted Bob! terrorist. Bob! You see, Bob! they do not condemn a convicted He's terrorist. Was Bob! Abu Qasim your friend? Bob done a do you condemn He's Abu Qasim? Do you, you, do you condemn Abu Qasim? I don't know who you are talking about. You don't know, plain, pl Tweedle Dum is plain ignorant. Do you condemn Abu Qasim? Do you condemn Bob? Do you? Do you condemn For what? Him? For what? He incited what? violence using the when? Bible. When? In the, in the, in the, 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 the what? What did he say? What did he say? What did he say? What did he say? Go to your phone right now. You go to your phone and tell me. I can't read another person. I know you can't. Can I? You can't read. Stop there. Tell us. If Bob is an extremist, tell us what he has incited. He incited and he celebrated the Andalusia attack as well. Yes. What did Where he say? He burnt people alive. Yes. He, he, he praised the people he for the he Muslims who them. had attacked the Christians. No. He praised oh, the lying. retaliation. See, you're a liar. Where's you're the evidence? Lying on history. In Bring me the evidence of what Bob said. On history. Bring the. It is documented in history. So do you accept what the Muslims in Andalusia did? Do you, do you, do you, do you see, they can't say, do you agree with what the Muslims did to the Christians in Andalusia? Do you agree with the massacre of Cordoba? Do you agree with the massacre of Cordoba? Can you answer? Do you agree? With the massacre of Cordoba, which happened in. Shall I read it for you? Shall I read it for you? All right. All right. I'm going to read to you what happened in Andalusia. I'm going to read to them the martyrs of Andalusia. 11 6 Corinthians. Please. 
answer the question why don't you shave Hatun's head? She doesn't cover her hair. So, six orders you to cover. The martyrs of Cordoba yes, were 48 Christian martyrs who were executed under the rule of Muslim Why conquerors in what is now southern hair. Spain at the time the area was known as Al Andalusia. Do you agree with this? This is Wikipedia. Do you agree with it? Do you agree with it? Do you agree with it? Do you agree? You see? Do you agree with what they did? Do you agree? 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 With that? Do you agree? The Bible orders you. The martyrs of Cordoba. Do you agree? Do you agree? Do you agree? What did he say? What did he say? Tell us what he said. All right. Listen properly. Listen properly. Which means to live in condemnation by the world, in objection to the world, in suffering from the world. You say that speech glorifying murder of Muslims. When Muslim. we start to take our faith seriously again, then the world around us will take our faith seriously. There is a reason why in this country you can blaspheme the Christ, but you cannot blaspheme. Hate Muhammad. preaching, boy, it's the hate. Murder. Listen what has he said that's hateful? Your friend right. just, okay. He's, he's reading the Bible. Because your big mouth friend has started okay, talking. He's reading the Bible. <laughs> no, just relax, relax. <laughs> Basically saying yeah, he's reading out from the Bible, yeah. inciting violence towards Muslims. I'm trying to hear the part. Okay, listen, he's telling he's saying the whole thing right now. What random is Pusha? This is not what the Christian faith calls us to. We are called to live the lives of saints on earth. And to live the life of saints, is that extremism? Listen to the whole context, ya paper boy! Listen to the don't whole context! Do not be biased. Listen to your colleague who's calling for murder yeah, in the streets of London. Because of this rhetoric, the mosque attack happened. Imam the Muazin got stabbed. Germany got shot up. People got shot up in the Shisha Cafe because of your rhetoric. You have and blood on your hands. Too. Blood and New Zealand attack. Too kick. In the, in the I'm, lungs I'm, on you see your attack. big mouth friends are talking <laughs> because you, you I can't hear. That, you, you go to random exposure. Why don't you tell your big mouth friends to my, be quiet? He's not my friend. He's just another humanitarian. Yes. Yes. He's just another humanitarian. A humanitarian. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, we're all humanitarian. Yeah, we humanitarian. came individually because see, we've seen your, your friends. Dean has failed him. You wanted me to listen, uh, and your uh, big uh, mouth uh, friend uh, is talking. Uh, how am I supposed to listen if Tweedledum is talking? You heard the hate to listen clearly. In the Book of Romans, to submit themselves to civil authority. This is true. However, Christians will only submit to civil authority in those things that are godly. Are godly. And therefore, when the state says to us, we should not do anything. Just hate Peter. 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 No, hate Peter. Peter. I'm trying to hear where the hate is. The biggest hate Peter in London. The British Britain. The biggest hate Peter in Britain. Bob the Builder. We shouldn't stand with them in their struggle. In their struggle. You hear that? We shouldn't stand with them in their struggle. So is that extremist? This is the whole context. Yeah, paper boy. Paper boy. Do you want subtitles as well? Do you want subtitles as well? Go out. Look He's quiet now. You see? The shock is. Look at the subtitle. Look. <laughs> See the face? Oh, That's Shamsi. What do you not? So, no, Shamsi Shamsi called you out. Okay, wait. So, so now out. tell me the part. Tell me the part. Yes. Tell me the part where, Listen, Shamsi where Bob, Bob was inciting extremism. He you out because of Andalusia attack. He realized his colleague Bob the Builder. You, you celebrate you this attack. You, you haven't shown me anything. Attacks. You praise Christian those terrorism. attacks on Andalusia. His face look at him and he's Bob shocked. praised this and said, this he's is shocked. the true ki Christian. The Christian, yes. so the Christian way is to burn people in stakes. Yes. The Christian way is to accuse people of witchcraft and burn, burn them. them. on the stake. <laughs> on the stake. But that's what Bob said. He's glorifying the Spanish Inquisition. The Spanish Inquisition is glorified. What do you say about that? You've you you not brought me any evidence. I'm trying to listen. You saw it Go to London and listen to yourself with headphones. Please do not listen to yourself with headphones. Listen to yourself with headphones. Deny it. Your own friend said it with his own mouth. What part from that you played me was extreme? Listen, you know what? You heard it all. 
I didn't hear anything. Block your ears with paper. Paper boy. With the paper you see, paper you didn't bring me anything. So, sh so shall we go to the words of your prophet? All right. Diversion tactics. Now you're going to lie again. Okay. Explain why why your colleague is being Now. That's a lie. Why? Tell us Your why. prophet said, I have been con a commanded a to fight Tell the people until they say la ila la ila la. If they liar. say it, then their blood and wealth are protected from me, except for you a right that is due from it. And their reckoning will be project. with Allah. Do you agree with that? Why, you you are a why is your trousers ripped? Why is your trousers ripped? Why is your trousers now, ripped? your prophet <laughs> said, the, the prophet said, I have been given five things which were not given to anyone else before me. Allah has made me victorious by all of frightening my enemies for a distance of one month's journey. The earth has been made for me and my followers, a place of prayer and something which is to perform. Just Therefore, like anyone, you're a liar. do you agree you with that? Like him. Your prophet can rule you, by terror. Who look like his mother, the Virgin Mary. Ali just came to him. some people of Al Azuk who worship idols and Virginia. burned them. I'm reading six, the words from your you're own liar. Islamic hadith. Am I lying here? We Let's see what again. Your prophet said, I have been commanded to fight the people until they say la ila la ila la. Do you agree with that? You are you do you mercy. agree with that? You are huh? Paper do you agree with the words of your prophet? That is inciting terrorism. Perfect. The Quran says you should go and engage in jihad. Do you agree with that? Do you agree with your Quran? Surah 9. 929 no, kill the disbelievers wherever you find them. Listen, listen, I'm gonna make an announcement. Why yeah? are you wearing chew. pink shoes? Yo, chew, 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 pink shoes, please. Chew, chew. One minute, yo, yo, one minute, yeah, chew, yeah. One minute, yeah. Okay, do you agree? Now to debate with this humanitarian. Humanitarian? Is he a humanitarian? One minute each. One minute each. He's a liar. One minute each, yes? You one minute, he's one, he takes another minute, okay? So okay. we have the humanitarian asking you his concern, okay? Yes. With Bob and your team, DCCI. Now he's going to forward this question to you right now. I'm not in DCCI. Have another to answer. You okay, go ahead. DCCI. You, you are a member of DCCI. You, you are a member of the DCCI. Of the of Hate preaching society against the Muslims. Now, why can't you answer the question? Your friend Bob the Builder has been spewing hatred in his. You speech. have not given me any he evidence. I listened to the video. He wants to be and take the Spanish Inquisition yes, in the this mic, time now, 2020. Yo, he wants to put mic, Muslims and Jews on the stake and burn them. When, like what they give me the statement where he said that. Check it on random exposure. Give me. We showed you the, the thing. I was listening. Your face and you're in shock. You were panicking. Yeah, 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 Anyways, I've got, 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 got a question for you. The Bible, the New Testament says in Corinthians 11:6, shave the hair of the women who are not covered. So when are you going to shave Hatun and Liz's hair? That is the one question. <laughs> Will you tell me about the verse of breastfeeding Listen, that okay, was in the Quran? Why are, pink shoes? why are you wearing pink shoes and blue jeans with ribs? Is Jesus okay, now let's ask Cor the Quran yeah. 9111. It says, question. indeed, Allah has purchased from the believers their Christians lives and their six. properties yes. for that they will have paradise. They fight in the cause of Allah, so they kill and they are killed. A true promise so upon him in the Torah the and the Gospels the of the Quran. Hatun. Yes. All right. Okay, Let me have my, my minute. Let's see if you answer him or you just deflect to something else. I asked him to give me the evidence of where Bob said these things specifically. I listened to the video and there was nothing according to your taqiyya. You are doing taqiyya. So if, if you're not Shia, why are you practicing taqiyya now? Because you were lying and you're making a fool out of yourself, making false claims against Bob. So now, answer my question. Fight those who do not believe in Allah or in the last day and you who do not consider unlawful what Allah the and his messenger have made unlawful. Do you agree with that? Do you agree with that statement? Do you agree with that statement? Do you agree with... Oh look, is that Muhammad Tawheed? I, have you? Know <laughs> yeah, oh, of course. Oh, I've oh, seen oh, the video of Saracen. Oh, stop, oh, stop, oh, stop oh, sending oh, pictures oh, to females. Oh, stop sending pictures. Stop, stop sending pictures 
to females. Hey, listen, to Stop to sending. Well, Let's get to some is that how you got the female to do shahada? Huh? Yeah. Is that how you got the females? Let's talk about one Samuel 15 9. Let's talk about how in the Bible it talks about killing man, woman, infant, suckling. Donkey. Do let's go again. Do you, let's go okay. again. Do you, let's talk about your book. Okay, let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Do you talk about it? Samuel 15, All right. 9. Now, I'm going to tell him. 1 Samuel 15, yes. 9. Now, according to his prophet. His Why are you prophet, going to my prophet? Because his prophet said, when a Jew tells you something of the Bible, 15, 9. do not deny it. Because if it is true, then you have committed an act of kuffar. Bring the tafsir of that. Uh, I'm gonna, because you you're going against the word of your prophet. Do you know what let me, is? let me show you what your prophet said. Because your prophet, your do you know let me, is? let me bring. Uh, do you know what tafsir is? I know what tafsir is. It's an explanation of the Quran. It's an explanation from the scholar. It's an explanation from a scholar. It's an explanation from the scholar. Generally, it's the the um the Quran. Yes. What's it called? Tafsir. Tafsir. Yes. Well done. Now I'm going. I'm going to bring. Respected. Scholars, I'm going yeah? to bring a hadith from your prophet where he said, If a Jew tells tafsir, you something, bring the tafsir that you said because I was hit in the background. Your diversion <laughs> tactics, yes, your paid diversion tactics, paid. So, you meetings, so you're paid. Your meetings, go and raise meetings, some more money for Uncle your Jamal. Meetings, your meetings, yes. that happen outside yes. of the corner, yeah. So he has committed. So shops, let me tell you, when Muslims shops, talk about Samuel, it, first Samuel 1 15, eyes, they have committed yeah? an act of kuffar right. according to their prophet. Not kuffar, he's not even making yeah, any sense. Make yes, sense. let me when because Samuel your prophet, your, let me reference, give you the words of your prophet, one by one, your prophet. One by one. Do you go against your prophet? 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 Because everyone is seeing his prophet said, if a Jew tells you something, do not deny what they tell you. In the right. Bible, yes. a general statement, and this is what it is. You know how they say we promote violence? Yes, yes. Now let's talk. 1 Samuel 15 9. 15, 9. Go smite the Amalekites wherever you find them. Spare not man. Now, Woman, do, you, do you have a problem with that? Infant. Do you? I'm asking you. I do. Do you? Uh, okay. Do you? Let me give you do my you, response. Do you? Yes or no? Let do me you have a response? Let me give you do my response. Do you have a problem? You want me to respond? Hold on. First of all, do you I invite, want me to respond? First of all, you invited yourself to the Quran. Can you bring the tafsir of the Quran or shall we go to the tafsir of this biblical verse? Do you want me to re that you respond? Promotes, you see? That he violence, doesn't want me to respond. That promotes, that promotes murder. Let, 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 that when promotes, you finish your... That promotes genocide. <laughs> you, spare he said not, he has a problem with this verse. Spare not man, woman, All right. infant. Suckling, do you know what suckling is? Babies. Small, you know baby, babies, you know yeah, baby. Babies, suckling, yeah, spare not. Donkey. Suckling. Suckling. Huh? Donkeys, donkeys as well. Donkeys. What did the donkey do to you? What did the donkey do to you? Do you want a response? Bring something in order for me to respect this intellectually. Okay. Because at the moment you are intellectually dishonest. Do you want me to respond? Before your response, do you condemn or condone this action? Now respond. Bir bin Abdullah reports that once Umar bin al khattab read a book which he had received book. from a Jew Come to the Prophet, he got angry book. and said, Oh, the son of al khattab are you book? embarrassed one, by the Samuel. one in whose hand is my life? I have brought to you something which is pure and immaculate. Don't ask them anything. There is a possibility that they tell you the truth and you refute it, or they tell you the false and you confirm it by the one the in whose hand is my life scripture. even if Musa was alive today he would have followed you me condemn, this is in Ahmad uh, Ibn Hanbal hadith 4763 so when Muslims go to the Bible men, and they reject women, it their prophet infant. has said Suckling. There is a possibility the that they tell you the truth and you refute it. Or they tell you the false or you may confirm it. So therefore, he has committed an act of kuffar because he does not fear Allah. Because on the day of judgment, Allah is going to ask him why he denied this verse. Because his, even his own prophet has told him they're not supposed to deny these things. So if a Jew comes to tell them something, they don't deny it because it could be true. Neither do they accept it because it could be false. But now we see they go against their own prophet. How embarrassing. They reject their own prophet, their own word. Do they fear Allah? Do you fear Allah? That they reject the words of their own prophet. How embarrassing.
You just How you embarrassing. The Muslims they crucified you. See, he couldn't answer. Own Their own prophet. Can you, you know, believe this? The Their own prophet. They because go against. Tell us what just you want to, to criticize the Bible. Just to criticize the Bible. Why are you wearing Nike? This is an act of kafar. 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 Nike is a pagan. Nike is a pagan. And one, two, three, four. Ah, this is an act of kafar. These are disbelievers. You're wearing pagan shoes. Why are you wearing pagan shoes? Your, your prophet condemns you. Answer the question. Why are you wearing kafar trainers? Why I Nike is a Greek goddess. Nike is a Greek goddess. That is a kafar trainers. Because if you didn't know, Nike is a yes. So why are you wearing kafar trainers? One Samuel fifteen three. Your trainers are dedicated. Your trainers and your tracksuit are dedicated to a pagan god. Why is your trainer's real? Why is the brand name? Why is the brand name? What is Nike? It's a Greek goddess. So you're wearing clothes with a pagan goddess's name on it. Nike Nike is a pagan goddess. Is you the Nike that God is not allowed to wear this. What, where, tell us. Your scholars have yeah. said you want to keep this baby, is an act of you kafar. Want to keep and you wear a pink shoe. Yeah. 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 One Samuel 15. Explain to me why you are rejecting the words of your prophet. Tell us the words. Are you intellectually dishonest or not? Because you're here talking. You're here making a you are here, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. There is a possibility you they you tell you the truth and you refute it. Blood dripping or from the Quran. Yeah, yeah. Let's talk about the knives, the knives in the Bible. Yeah, in the Bible. Let's talk about genocide, genocide in the Bible. Let's talk, let's talk about, about child abuse let's talk in the Bible. Yeah. Let's talk about sending dick pics. Shall we do that? Let's talk about that. Would you send a picture of your private parts to a six-year-old? Would you? Would you? I'm asking you. He has been exposed. Exposed by fellow Muslim of extending in indecent pictures to women, Muslim women. Look at the people instead. Why? Can you tell us why? On camera, why are you exposed by fellow Muslim of sending? In decent pictures to fellow Muslim women. Do you want to pick? That say that. You see. That say that. Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. Do you want to see? Slow down. Why? Why were you sending pictures? Why? Why are you sending pictures? He was exposed by a fellow Muslim. Your Bible is not good enough for you. What you need, what you need to do is. You were exposed. You were exposed. Go get all your money in your way. Can you tell us? Because you're never you going to get. You're never going to get what you want in your da'wah. Yeah. Is that how you do da'wah? Is that how you do da'wah? Let's get Sarah in next week. Keep him here. One my friend, Samuel would you send pictures of your private parts one to Samuel fellow Muslim women? 15 3. Would you send one, one, one Samuel, Samuel 15 3. Why were you doing one that? Samuel 15 3. 15 3. Would you send one Samuel 15 3. One Samuel 15 3. Are you gay? Would you are you gay? Are you gay? Would you send the title of a young boy? Are you gay? 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 Would Jesus be happy with the church? You hate your whole life. You disagree with the Old Testament. Are you gay? Would you bring a point up? You say, oh, that's Old Testament. Oh, no. Old Testament. You're a Muslim. Spit on the Old Testament. You hate the Old Testament. You hate the Old Testament. We don't hate the Old Testament. Do you agree with what he said? So the verse that he said about killing the donkey, do you agree with it or disagree with it? Why are you wearing tight jeans and female shoes? The whole time, the Bible is not Because Allah gave Moses a book. How do you know? Can you prove it? Can you prove it? Which part? We can prove it's valid. We can prove the Bible is valid. Show me. Listen to what I'm saying. Allah gave Moses a book. Oh, the Torah. Manchester Moses was given the Torah. How old is that Quran in there? How old is that Quran in there? Exact same Quran that is today. Your Bible is not the same as the Quran. Your Bible is not the exact same Quran that is today. No, your Bible is not the same as the Quran. Your Bible is not the same as the Quran. Your Bible is not the same as the Quran. Your Bible is not the same as the Quran. Your Bible is not the same as the Quran. Your Bible is not the same as the Quran. Your Bible is not the same as the Quran. Your Bible is not the same as the Quran. Your Bible is not the same as the Quran. Your Bible is not the same as the Quran. Your Bible is not the same as the Quran.
Bible is that uh, 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 now? Kings have changed your Bible. Yes, Who wants me kings to read the verse, the hadith, where your, pro yes, your prophet used to have semen all over his clothes and would pray in it? Do you want to, can I read it? Oh, you know what I'm talking about. Now, would you come to the park with semen on your clothes? Why you me the hadith? You said you know it. You know it. Now, answer my question. Would you come to the park with semen on your clothes? Would you pray? You can't pray with urine on your clothes. Exactly. Like, it's fluid, exactly. it's water. Did your prophet pray, you know. pray with semen on his clothes? Oh, you know, we're just saying drenched in semen. Yeah. Yeah. What was the word you used? Did your shaitan. prophet pray with semen in his clothes? Do not fall for you may, you may have Would you pray with yeah. semen on your clothes? Yeah. If I had it on my clothes and I didn't know, then y'all love it. Ah, see, you got this guy. So if it was, if it's you did not, dirt, you know, let's say this, it's I'm you, asking you, you are from according to your you are, from, are you from Ewan? I would not are you from come, are you from I'm asking are you. Are you from Ewan? You could go to the I church. I don't believe you could go in to the what you're, you're going with your wife your and you come straight to church. You, you go to your wife, you go to your wife, would you pray with semen on your clothes? You go to your wife, you come to church. Would you pray, would you go to the mosque with semen on your clothes? Would you kill a baby? Answer yes or no. Would you kill a baby? Would you I'm asking you, would you do? You you can't can't say, say, I'm asking, would you, you, you do it? Answer, would you do it? You can't, 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 we're only here because we love Jesus. We love Jesus. You know, you you know, know he's going to hate you. When he comes back, he's going to hate you. Hate he's going to break the cross. He's going to break the cross. He's going to hate you. He's going to hate you. Allahu Akbar. Come, let's go, my mom. Okay, here it is. This is Bukhari. Okay, let's go. So you can see. Bukhari. Okay. Bukhari. Read it, read it. Can we can we talk for a second? Bible or Quran? Well, let me please with the reference and then you... Okay, you, 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 because I'm going to bring you one. You know yeah. you're talking about dicks and this this and that. I'm going to bring you dicks in your Bible. No, but what, Let's paint a picture now. Let's paint a picture. Let's paint a picture. He's yeah? going yeah. to say Old Testament. He'll be like, oh, it's Old Testament. Yeah, all of a sudden he's going to say Old Testament. All of a sudden he's going to say, oh, I hate the Old Testament. Okay. Madness. This one, Sahih. It says, a guest came and stayed with Aisha and she ordered that he be given a yellow blanket of hers. He had a nocturnal emission on it and he felt I'm too shy to I'm send it back to send it back to her I'm talk when about it had traces that Bible. of that emission on it. Oh so he dipped it in water you talk about and mine? then sent it to yeah? her. Let me talk about I just said, your book why one? did he spoil right. the garment? Now we'll it would have been sufficient for him to yeah. scrape it off with his finger. Get ready. I often scraped yeah, it, not have semen from the garment of the messenger with yes. Allah with my finger. It's to show it's not impure. You're made from that. You're made from this semen. It's not impure. It's not impure. Will you go to the mud? Yes, I would. If the prophet did that, you come to the I would. I would. I would. I don't think it's impure. I stuff for Allah. We we have the we have the good of the You can touch your you can touch your Bible of the sex of your wife. We can't even touch your Quran about of the sex of your wife. You know how you are pre But but
I'm going to assume mm. that you're a better Christian than I am a Muslim. Okay. I'm going to assume that you follow God mm. better than I follow God. Okay. I'm going to just hypothetically now, yeah. and I don't know if you are or not, and I respect everyone's privacy regarding their personal and family life here, but let's paint a hypothetical now yeah. Yeah. that you have a nine-year-old daughter. You know, what did you say, Aisha was nine or six? What, what age did you mention? Married at six, comes to me to cool. nine. You pick a number for your daughter's age. So we say six, let's say six to make it sound more uh, hot. Okay. Yeah, more heated no, no, no. of a discussion. Okay. Yes. So a nine-year-old, six-year-old, sorry, six-year-old daughter comes to you. Let's give her a name as well. We'll call her what? Aisha. Should we call her Aisha? But you're, you're, you're a Christian, so let's not be funny, let's be real. We'll give her a name that both of us use. Or we say Mariam, you say Mary. We say Mariam, you say Mary, yeah? Just so you don't think there's a pun intended, yeah? Cool, safe. So, in the Bible, uh, Mary comes up to you. Little, cute, six-year-old Mary. You know, your, your wife now has just sent her up to, the, to come and give her daddy a kiss goodnight and say, Daddy, can you read me a bedtime story? Because you are such a good Christian, you've raised your daughter to a standard where, may God bless her, she loves to hear the word of God, yeah? So she says, Daddy, you say to her, what would you like me to read, read for you, sweetheart? She says, Daddy, I would like you to read for me the Bible. You say, okay, where in the Bible? You just open the Bible. You say, let's see where God guides us to. So you open the Bible. <laughs> 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 this guy, let's be objective. Let's, let's, let's be objective let's, let's, here. Let's paint the hypothetical. Like, so realistic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's realistic. All right. Yeah, yeah. Look, now he's going Hadith, Imam Bukhari, Shaitan, something. <laughs> but let, now let's stick on this, inshallah, yeah, yeah, yeah. because I genuinely have not had an answer in four years about this. Okay. Cool, all right. Cool. cool. So you open a Bible, mm. and in front of you is Ezekiel twenty-three twenty. Mm -hmm. Now I'm reading from the New Living uh, Edition mm -hmm. translation. A ring for King James. We can do either. Yeah, Bro, we, we can go in all of them because one is one is hanky panky, one is hanky panky, one is one is jiggy jiggy. Yeah, all right. Ring from King James. Yeah, because you brought the jiggy jiggy to me. Yeah, ring from King James. So let's talk jiggy yeah, jiggy. Yeah, you want to talk about me jiggy jiggy? I'm going to talk about your jiggy jiggy. Read from the King James. I'll start with this and we'll go to that. Just read from the King James. I'll start with this and you go to that. Just read the King James. Because your daughter came and brought you two rings. One is New Living. Read from the King James. from the King James. I'm reading from this. You know why he wants me to read King James? Why? Because you want me to read an English that is not because you accept it. I'll read from the ESV then. Thank you. ESV. Yeah, fine. Yeah, yeah, fine. All right. Good. Yeah, there. ESV. There. E -S -S there. She yeah. lusted after her lovers. So imagine little six-year-old girl who wants to get to God to paradise, you know, and she loves Jesus Christ. She loves her dad and she loves her mom. Yeah. She's sitting down. She wants a bedtime story before she goes to sleep. Mm. Yeah. What's the there. She lusted after her lovers whose genitals were like those of donkeys, <laughs> and whose and whose and whose emission brackets sperm brackets spunk brackets semen, and whose emission was like that of horses. So now let's just, let's break this down for the layman. Daddy opened the book to six-year-old Mary. He talks there about donkey dick, <laughs> donkey dick, donkey penis, and horse sperm. Now, if someone was to tell me, if someone was now to come to tell me, do you know why I say this with no door on my language? Because this is the language of apparently God. Mm. Now, God's word is apparently for all. Yeah? Subhanallah, it's mad how the light went darker when I spoke about this dark verse, isn't it? The irony here. Yeah? The irony here. Yeah? So what I'm trying to say to you, yeah? If you do believe in the book that you you say you defend, and I respect anyone who defends their book, but why I call you intellectually honest is because I would like to hear from you now. Yeah? Well, I don't even know your name. I, I, I've never it's spoken to you before. His name is Paperboy. Yeah? Paperboy? <laughs> okay. All right, cool. So, Paperboy, I'm talking about the paper on 2320. On top, on top. How can you justify. Wait, 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 wait. wait. So let, me, let me get some light. Similar to this. SubhanAllah, I've been in the park for under half an hour. My voice has gone already. No, no, he's just putting the light on. No, you're here. Give it to me. I'll put it here. Put it here. I'll put it here. Right. It's like a two minute. Two lights. Battery, battery. Finish. Okay. Come cool. on, come on. So how let's can go, let's go, let's go. Okay. So cool. Round how two. can we? Um, look, I've spoken to many Christians here. Mm. I've learned a lot about Christianity from Christians, mm. from my mother as well, who used to be a Christian. She was raised as a Christian. Yeah. But when I read your Bible, mm. yeah, and I see verses like this, mm. I ask myself, why is there so much infatuation and emphasis that the Christians will put onto? the Muslims regarding hadith 
when I am not even going to hadith here, or should I say prophetic stories? I'm going to the actual scripture itself. Yeah, but your hadith yeah, but is an authority. Are you so sure you want to start your your, ref, your rebuttal the, with yeah, but? I'm saying to because you because it will get flawed. I'm Take saying to you, you're going to the Bible, which is an authority for Christians. Yeah. Christians will go to the Quran and the Hadith because they are both authorities for okay. you as Do a you Muslim. Do you know the chain of... So you speak about the scripture for us. Okay. We should only speak about the Quran because, again, both are authorities for you. I'm going to agree with you on a point, but I'm going to expand on something mm. as well for you, inshallah. The reason why I brought this up, mm. paper boy, you want me to refer to you as paper yeah, boy? Yeah, yeah, right, cool. right. My name is Muhammad. You can call me whatever you like. Mm. Yeah? Is because Quran, we know it's Allah's word. Yes. yes? Hadith. Mm -hmm. If it's Sahih. Yeah, if it's Sahih. Yes. Now, have you been able to today mm -hmm. reference any of the Hadith? And when I asked you earlier to bring the Tafsir, the Tafsir of, of the Quran, of the Quran, what did you do? You you left the Quran and selectively went to Hadith. Yes. So you put more emphasis on the Hadith and you turn your back on our book. Firstly. This is the first point. I'm bringing you, because if you were to say to me now, Vapor Boy, I'm gonna show you what your God says. Yes. So there's no, there's no subjugation mm -hmm. in regards to the opinions we have regarding which Imams we follow about Hadith and the chain of narration. So, so are you it, rejecting an authentic Hadith? No, no, I would so never reject it. The reason hadith. why I brought it up, yeah. because if you're going to criticize the Bible, your prophet said very clearly when a book was given to Umar, that you should not believe what the Jews say because they could be lying, but then you should not reject what they say because they could be telling the truth. Now, if you are attacking something in the Bible and you have no explicit confirmation in the Quran, that means you do not fear Allah. Because if Allah has told you, or the Prophet at that time, this very thing, you have no criteria to reject it. All you can say is, I believe in the Quran and the Prophets and the last hour as you are instructed could you to. could you attack hadith without attacking the quran or vice versa can i attack the hadith without, without attacking the quran what do you mean can i attack the could you place scrutiny on hadith yes and leave the quran at bay without your scrutiny depends on what hadith i'm talking about okay depends on what hadith you're talking about now if i okay depends on which hadith if i was to now i'll tell you the point why i'm getting to it inshallah because i'm just trying to hit a certain process in your mind today. yeah if i open one page of the quran any page mm -hmm. any page of the quran and i see something that is questionable if anyone here questions one verse of the quran are you a muslim or a kafir because the quran is a collective haqq, okay. collective knowledge that Allah has given us. Now, okay. fine. The Bible for you is a collective knowledge, is it? Or not? Yeah. So if I open the book and I find you a verse that talks about donkey penis and horse. Uh, what is that verse talking about? Huh? What is that verse talking about? Now we're going to get to the crux. Yes. The Bible is for all mankind. Yes or no? Not to follow, but as a reference of historical value. Because as I was saying, you say, want to turn the light up on it. Because the <laughs> reason light enough now. Because because now but, no because oh, now oh, the light has come onto because paper boy. it's very clear. Because you had something and called. This is the minute where because, paper boy. Because you had something the called the Mosaic laws, which were for the Israelites, and then Christ came with a new teaching. Because if you believe that Christ didn't, because even in your Quran it says, Christ made halal certain things that were impermissible abrogation, abrogation yeah. right so, so that i'm saying that to you so that's not a verse that we had to follow it's just saying something historically that's why i said what would is you that read verse it to about? your daughter would i read it to my daughter <laughs> my, my daughter would read the whole bible the bible says study the scripture to know yourself would you comfortably paper boy would you comfortably yes because read? my daughter would ask me what is this verse talking so about hold on. and i would tell her it's talking about it god likening okay. israel All right. Okay, so Israel's so relationship with idolatry right. to one of to fornication, which God detests. So he's using uh, it's using explicit terms, but if you read the whole verse, it's talking about Israel, um, their relationship with idolatry, and it's comparing it to them lusting after like a horse or whatever it was. Sorry, like, it called 
Um, it used Sorry, the term, can I just, it I used just the term, want to put my hands on my kids. It used the term... Because that's very it naughty, used, man. It used Stand away the from him, he's a naughty man. It compared Israel to a horse. Laughing after, so, laughing after so something. So here we have a man, and this is the first time I've met you, Paperboy. Yes. And why I say you're intellectually mm. dishonest. Okay. I'll tell you now. All right. Because here is a man, okay, mm. that has tried to justify a man who attacks. Now this is where we get to the crux. Attacks what? I'm going to get to it. Yes. A man who attacks... Mm. Islam through either hadith or Quran, yeah, about you, I, yeah. about about the diplomacy of the family of Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. Me personally, the, the ultimate, hold on, hold on, paper boy, I'm gonna get to it. All right, you take it a long way. Okay, like let me get route. to the crux right, of the matter. I'm standing next to a man here mm -hmm. that has defended, yes. saying to his six-year-old girl, speaking mm. to his six-year-old girl before she falls asleep, <laughs> yes, about. Horse dick and donkey sperm. But this is the same person who would defend to a six year old, a fifty four year old man sleeping. Would you let your fifty would you let your six year old daughter sleep with a fifty four year old man? Why are you playing diversion tactics? Oh, I'm asking oh, you. Yeah. Why can't we Because I'm calling out double <laughs> standards. Yeah, yeah. Why can't we do <laughs> it one matter? Because I'm trying to Open highlight your hypocrisy. Open the Quran. I'm highlighting Open the Quran. now. <laughs> Answer the question. I answered Say in question. the name of your Lord. I answered his question. Open the Quran. I, second, I answered right, your right, question. I, I don't want us to. So, would you let your six year old sleep with a 50 year old? year old man i'm going to say to you mm. that for me to start entertaining this yes. we haven't even finished we haven't put a full stop on the first point why did you read about horse dick and donkey spam to your six-year-old daughter i told you why the what? verse is talking about israel's um is that right? relationship with idolatry is that, right? is that, right? is that because right? it's talking about is that okay it's, it's okay it's okay it's, do you want me to finish wow. it's okay wow. because wow. so so hold on what's worse reading about. a verse about uh, donkey, it. um, Why are you shy? Are you it's shy? your God's word. Say it. Let me say donkey dick yeah. now. Horse bum. Let's let's get say this it. in context. It's in your Bible. We're, we're, we're comparing words. Why are you shy about it? What's yeah, worse, words word. or a fifty-four-year-old man sleeping with a six-year-old? Which one is worse? Because I'm saying, he, how he can get, you complain? Get to that. Do you yeah. know what? Do you know what, guys? We were stuck. Thank you. Do you know, paper boy? Look, I have to respect the fact that you're here week in week out, and you have a certain adequate amount of knowledge regarding your religion. I do also. I understand and again on, I read I do, the hadith about what your prophet said I do also now you're denying it so you do not fear Allah did you hear me deny or you do not yeah. did you hear me deny so you have a problem with that no, no, no. Ezekiel verse don't put words in my mouth no, and don't take do words from out my mouth do you have a problem with that Ezekiel verse yes okay so when your prophet said when the Jews tell you something do you not accept it or reject it are you going with or against what your prophet said you see this moment here yes you know, all of us, our, mm. even me, my ego gets the better of me. I'm asking I can, you. I can F up Because sometimes. I'm highlighting you know now? Do you know now? how yeah. they you know go now? against Let the words of their very now. own prophet. Look, I've just said, mm. my ego yeah. can get the better of me sometimes. I'm just a man, okay. right? Yeah. This is the moment now mm. that your ego got the better of you. No, it hasn't. Number one. Yeah. Number two, you proved, proved yourself to be intellectually dishonest because mm. you tried to justify what do they call it? Bestiality. Yeah. Bestiality? Yeah. Bestiality. Yeah. Is that animal? It's not talking about. It's not literally talking about. It's a parable. It's a bestiality setting it's a to do metaphor. with concentrating on animal. It's called a metaphor. Is it's this called, a metaphor? Yes, or because it? it's talking about Israel. Uh, okay, so so let's go back to it. Okay, cool. I walk into the park. All right, I want to find God. All right. I got up to and a this is the same person who was sending please. dick pictures See, look, to fellow Muslim women. You, you, you have no. It. You can't handle it. You have no. You can't handle it. The audacity. So now, you can't handle it. You can't handle it. You can't handle it. The audacity. No, 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 no. He's obviously got a fascination. I'm telling you, with penises. I'm telling me. Only penises. This is the person that was sending penises to fellow Muslim women. Let's go back to the Bible. Go exposed. Can't do it. And we're going to edit that into this video. I know how to deal with your type. Yeah. Know what, 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 I know how to deal with your type. What would you do? Wait, 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 w
I have said Ezekiel 23, 20. Memorize it. Okay, let's You have tried to justify it. You have tried to justify it. Horse, dicks, and donkey spark. Okay, wait, 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 Go you to your Bible that you read to your nonsense. six year old daughter. Okay, let me tell Now you're you intellectually disabled. First point, yeah. you see? Secondly, who engaged in bestiality? Answer their question. Your Bible, answer the question. Animal, who engaged in bestiality? What's the bus? 23, who was the bus? In bestiality. There you go. The same guy you spoke to, speak to you now. Speak to him now. my question. Speak to him now. Who? Why are you lost the words? Why are you doing that? Why are you going to you and I? Let's go back to the book. Let's go back to the book, paper boy. Let's go back to your book. I'm asking you. Who can't do it? In bestiality. So I say, I'll leave it with you lot now. What's the verse? I'm asking you. 2320. What's the verse? I'm asking you. 2320. I'm asking you. You say he's running away. I'm here. I'm here. You know what? I'm here. So okay. so I'm here. 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 I'm no. no. Uh, so up, Why not? Up, I don't. I don't have a daughter. Yeah. I know. I, would I don't have a. Ah, you see? Do I have a daughter? <laughs> but I answered his yeah, question. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> right. yeah. Even if I did, uh, yeah. I wouldn't. But Why not? Uh, answer yours. I'll answer mine. Why not? Answer mine. I'll answer yours. yours. Answer, yours. answer mine. I'll answer yours. Why not? Mine came before yours. Why not? Answer mine. I'll answer yours. I've taken it. You see? Running away. Is this running away? All right. Let me call this a victory walk. What do you want to call it? Because I bought you Bible. You brought you, you, you brought me, me. Yeah, I'm telling you about your book. Okay. Paper boy, go back to the paper boy. So, go back we go to the, we go to the, we go to the Quran. Where it says your prophet can have any single woman on the earth. That's called diversion tactics. No, 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 because you, you want to run away. What's your name, brother? Okay, hold on, hold on. Say, you know what I don't like? I'll tell you why I've answered your question you know once, yeah. twice, three times. He's someone who comes with loaded questions to the park, which loaded you do. Questions. And you came to a, mashallah, young Muslim boy no, that no, maybe he doesn't he necessarily exactly. know your little You're entrapment. Right. But when right. I brought you an entrapment verse, okay. you started going you, to between my legs. Why are you in a kiss? Why, why, why were you sending to you know what? To you, man. Man. What's the verse? Why, 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 why are you sending? Ezekiel! Look behind you! Why? The Satan! Why? 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 <laughs> That's it. Ezekiel 2320. Why are you on the game Stick website? Stick on that. Stick on that. Why are you on the game website? Paperboy, why are you the game website? Running away. Satan King next to the paperboy. Running away. Say hello to Satan. Satan. <laughs> Where, where's he gone? Why is he running away? Anytime, anytime he comes to the park, let's do Motaweed. Motaweed, why are you sending? No more, no more. Mohammed Taweed, don't send pictures to females. It's funny, he's got fascination with dicks of all kinds. You know why? Because it's in his Bible. Why are you sending female? And you exposed by a fellow Muslim. You exposed by a fellow Muslim. This guy, you're going to be on a police watch list. You're going to be on a police watch list. You're going to be on a police watch list. The Satan came to aid you. The same thing for your help. Why don't you come here? You have the demon. What's the verse? What's the verse? What's the verse? Why won't you let your six-year-old sleep with a fifty-year-old man? Why won't you let your six-year-old sleep with a fifty-year-old man? You can't answer that question. You see, clearly, he has embarrassed himself. He's committed an act of kafar. He's gone against the words of his own prophet that said, when Jews bring you something, do not accept it because they might be lying, but do not reject it because they could be telling the truth. But then when they have no criteria to reject verses in the Bible, they're going against their prophet. They do not fear Allah. 
Because on the day of resurrection, when Allah says, why did you reject the verses that I gave to my prophets? What are they going to say? So clearly we see they throw under the bus their scholars, their prophet, their Quran, everything just to make an argument. They have no leg to stand on and when we ask the questions back, they run away. <laughs> How embarrassing. Yeah. And he didn't answer the question. Why was he sending pictures of his private parts to fellow Muslim women that another Muslim had to expose him about it? You see? Okay, cool. But he ran away. I see, I see. Look, he can't talk about his Bible, he's talking about a man's Shut private down. part! <laughs> <laughs> and don't keep this! Don't keep the in your book, paper boy! Shut down! Look at your paper, Shut paper down. boy! Shut, Shut down! We're talking about your books! I reckon you want an exclusive picture of me because your book has got you sexually charged! Don't worry, man. That's right! Because your book contains pornography in it! Ezekiel! What is the verse? Ezekiel? 23? 20! Paper boy! <laughs> you shouldn't be. Is that how you give dawah? Targeting young Muslims. Is that how you give dawah? Is that how you give dawah? Is that how you give dawah as well? Have you been following his tactics? He has a water on his phone, and he thinks. He oh, man. Yo, why do you ban what? Yo, guys, we got Pepe here. Why what do you, you ban what? Why are you on the gay website for? Why, why do you, you, you ban what? Tweedle Dean, Tweedle Dumb. Have sex with. You do not have sex with. Until next time. Oh, thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you, guys. Do not have sex with fruit. I know you like to get fruity. All right, all right. Let's go. Let's go. I need to chant my friend. Continue. You are engaging with the people of God. You are going against the Bible. You are against. Would you suck? The tongue of a young boy. It's 2020. 2020. Rent a donkey. Would you suck the tongue of a young boy? Would you suck the tongue of a young boy? Just as your prophet did. Shia, 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 Shia. Suck the tongue of a young boy. Would you do it? That's what I thought. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. You are a Shia. You see, who here is brave enough to say it will suck the tongue and read his daughter Ezekiel 2320? My paper boy. Here with oh, 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 a 50-year-old man and a 60-year-old daughter. You won't answer the question. Oh, 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 Let me shake your hand. You know why? Because there's two ways that people can go about things in the park. Yeah. I made a statement. I said you were intellectually dishonest. The reason yeah. why I said that is because I anticipated you going to add hominems because yes. you couldn't answer what I said. I gave you an you answer. I told you, you it is a metaphor. Let me tell you something. By, it by, the, way, by the 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 way, you ask by the way, me a question. By the way, by the you way, see, he, I'm answering the question paper again. Boy, I said I would read it to my daughter to learn what is in the Bible. By the way, I would explain to her that it is a metaphor about Israel. I just want to give a disclaimer. As Muslims. We become kuffar if we believe that the original Bible is not from Allah. Just no, that's not. Because you, you teaching me about because you, yeah. Let me finish. Bye, you, bye. Let, me finish. Let, me finish. let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. Donkey Dick you, teaches us about you, Islam. You, yeah, that's crazy. Dick Pick guy. <laughs> All right. Doesn't know you want to call me that? We'll call you Donkey Now. Dick Pick guy is worse oh, because you're the guy. Now, this, this is the fact. Did you hear that? This is the fact. That's the now, horror of the Muslims believe. That's the horror now, of Ezekiel okay, 22. Now, let me ask you this question. Can we go back? Let me ask you this question. I want to say that. I'll show you why I shook your hand. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Slow down, please. Slow down, please. Okay, okay, let me ask you a question. Wait, no, no, no. Wait, wait. Let me let me finish what I'm saying. First, we need a criteria. Let me finish what I'm saying. First, we need a criteria. Let me. You made the principle. Let's have a criteria. Let's have a criteria. No, no, no. Hold let on, hold us on. have a criteria. Let's, 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 let us have, have a criteria. Don't you hold me, I'm not finished my sentence. Let us have a criteria. Let me finish my sentence and go The Bible has real verses and corrupted verses. Why are you wearing pink yes. trainers for? Now what is the criteria to determine of the corrupted trainers? verses? Okay, I'll tell you. recognize right. you as a man. Wait, wait. Here's a good question. Yes. But wait. before we continue, we Let's need a criteria. First. All right, cool. Right. But before we continue, says, the demon is. <laughs> who's got, who's got water? Has anyone got water? The demon no, 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 no. Let me check. Let me check. So, what was anyone, the prophet that was sent to hold on, the man. UK? Try not, listen, I'm trying to talk to you guys, okay. and I'm telling you that every prophet messenger we believe, including Jesus, peace be upon him, yes. any Muslim who speaks ill of Jesus, any Muslim who speaks, any Muslim who speaks ill of Jesus, peace be upon him, is a kafir. They're not a Muslim. Yeah. Any Muslim who speaks ill of Musa, Sulaiman, all of the prophets and messengers. Okay. If you speak ill of them, if you deny them, mm. you're not a Muslim. Because verily, one of the pillars of Iman, one of the pillars of faith, there's six pillars of faith as a Muslim, five pillars of Islam. One of the pillars of faith, the 
third, third one yeah. is to believe in the prophets and messengers. Yes. Then to believe in their scriptures. Yes. I will answer one of your questions because it's a very simple one to answer, okay. All right? Yes. And sincerely, if you are actually using it because you want the answer to this or you want to use it with the Muslims, I'm going to let you know that I know the answer for this. Inshallah. Okay. Okay, cool. So earlier you said that the Quran says to go refer to the people of the book, yes? And you spoke about what do we take from the religions? Because you asked me if I believe that all of the scripture yes. was... How do you determine the corruption right, cool. and the non-corruption? Now this is why I'm trying to tell you the principle that I was bringing. I'll okay. tell you what it is. The principle that we bring as a Muslim yes. is that Allah is above his creation. Okay. If you go back to the original Christians yes. and the original Jews, yes. if you tell them la ilaha illallah, yes. they, they accept it. Can you bring me evidence of that? My, my, it, my mother was Google like that before she became a Muslim. She was a Roman Catholic. Okay. Yes. I've got family who are... There's no God but Allah. Allah. Yeah. I've got family, my mother's All sister's a Jehovah's Witness. Yeah. Hold Do on. you accept La ilaha illallah? La ilaha illallah is in La ilaha illallah. Hold on. Do you accept La ilaha illallah? I've spoken to him as well. La ilaha illallah Jesus bin Yahweh. Okay, thank you. Okay, let me change the words for you. There's no one worthy of worship but God. Okay. We'll change it. Yes. We'll change it instead of Allah. Even though the word Allah is in your book in Genesis, first chapter. It's there. No, it's not. It's there. Go over it and not come back to me, inshallah. Not in Hebrew. Elohim. When you look, say, well, okay, let me ask you. I'm going to prove it to you. Yeah? But when you say, let's not divert. When you let's say, just, but let's not divert. No, but, but you already yeah, took somewhere let's, else. Yeah, but Hallelujah let's, comes from Ya yeah, Allahu Ya, yeah, by the way. <laughs> Hallelujah comes from yeah. Yahovah. Ya yeah, Allahu Ya. Yeah. No. Go check it. It's go not. check ya it. Ya is short for oh, man, Yahweh. Yahovah. I, I know it. I, I, can, I can bring it up on my phone right now. Go check it. Go research. Shall I bring it up on the phone right now? Go to Sheikh Google. Go check it. Okay. You know your paper, boy, so do your paper. Let's just stick on topic because you clearly don't know what you're talking about. Let's stick anyway, on topic. all right, cool. Let's stick on topic, fine. The point I'm trying to make is that as Muslims, what we use to establish whether it's haq or not haq mm. is if it sticks upon the principles of tawheed, putting Allah above his creation. So, for instance, if you open the Bible to me and you said, okay, Muhammad, mm. I want you to tell me and point to me which verses are true and which verses are not. I'll say, I'm sorry, I can't tell you which verses are the truth okay. that are originally from the Bible. Okay. But if you pointed at some verses that contain shirk, yeah, so I can tell you, wallahi, yes. I know as a Muslim that these verses are not original. Why? Because okay. my principle All right. being established of right. tawheed okay. is there because a Muslim, thank you for your patience. I'm nearly done, I promise you. Mm. Because a Muslim cannot be a Muslim without two, two pillars. Mm. And I'll tell you what they are. And a lot of Muslims, mm. they don't know this, inshallah, let's learn this, yeah? Mm. When we make a shahada, before we accept Allah, you know like how the Christians will promote Jesus, 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 our Lord Jesus, this, Jesus, that. Mm -hmm. We do this with Allah as well. Yeah, Allah, yeah, Allah, yeah, Allah. But before we accept Allah, we reject everything else. Okay. But in order for us to reject everything else, we must understand the differentiation between creator and evidently creation. Okay, so, so first Samuel 15, which you keep reading. 1 Samuel 15, one, three. yeah. How go, you know, that, that, that no does not running, come no under the classification of shirk. So then, un shirk. exactly. So how then can you go against and say you don't believe in that verse? I'll tell you why I don't believe in it. Why? Because one of Allah's the names. Goes, yes. Yeah. Now I'm gonna get to it. Because one Allah we, from us we have 99 names. Okay. Okay. One of Allah's names is Ar Rahman. Okay. And one of them is Ar Rahim. Okay. We say this at least 17 times a day in our salah. Okay. At least. Yeah. Yeah. Ar-Rahman means the most gracious okay. and Ar-Rahim means the most merciful. So, when so let me explain to you. I'm getting it. I promise you I'm getting it. Okay. <clears throat> so when there's a verse that says, mm. go kill mm. men, women, mm. fine. Uh, okay, I can understand the men part. If the men are like soldiers that have attacked Christianity. Yeah, yeah. Like if the verse was to say, go but kill the invaders. But this is I'll tell you Hold why. On, please, because let, let me finish. But let me just, let's finish, have a dialogue because you've been speaking point. a lot. All right, let me just hit on the verse, I promise you. Yeah, I, because, 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 because he wouldn't say that. But what I'm trying to say to Why you. Why can't I finish my verse? You're going to kiss on something that I, I haven't know, finished But all yet. I'm going to say please. is this. The no, Lord, no, no. Islam was not given man. to the Jews. I don't want to battle egos here. It's not about egos, but so this let's is just what I'm go saying. to the verse. Look, it, you Islam, love your religion. Islam, you love okay. your religion. Okay, but I love my this, religion. Address this in, in your religion. I don't response. love you. You don't love me. Address this in I your, don't love your Bible. No, no. You don't love my Quran. My, my, but we love Jesus our own scriptures. Instructs so us to love you. Your Quran instructs you to hate me. There's a difference. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, don't open it. I'm going to floor you. Well, I'm going to floor you now. Don't do that. You can floor me afterwards. You can floor me afterwards. That's intellectually dishonest. You can floor me afterwards. People, boy, I know my stuff. Now, my mother address that afterwards. I know my That's stuff. That's fine. Please. Adr address it I don't know atheism but, too well. But now, I don't know other religions too well. Now, but please don't try this funny business of Christianity with me. Let don't me, do that. Take that let, back. Otherwise, no, I'll floor you now. You'll floor me afterwards. But oh, let's go point by yeah, point. Let's go point by point. You're very spooky. You know that. Now, you my point was this. Islam was not given to Jews. 
So the commands that they had to follow were not. If you say why Allah, you say, because I'm vote. saying you say. No, listen to what I'm saying. I'm listening to what you're saying. I don't know why. I'm not diverting. You should be listening to me. You said that you you don't believe Allah would give an instruction to kill women or children or donkeys or whatever. Do you know why? No, no, no. Hold on. Do you know why? Let me conclude that point. So because he's the most merciful. Okay. And the most. I could have said that for myself. Then. One but but the is, whole point is, when the right, floods of Noah right, came, no, on, when yeah, Sodom and Gomorrah can, was destroyed, guys, there was no mercy, there was no graciousness, they were all wiped out. Them they them were exactly, so the point of the matter team. is, when I can't hear you, I'm sorry. When, 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 no fucking tell them, Sherwin, don't take no shit. When God, they strong. There's some people that can, I can't. Yes, the point is, Boy, when Allah right. gives, when God gives a decree to wipe something out, whether it's a flood or hellstone by Sodom and Gomorrah, because a prophet is a tool or the voice of God. So God, a prophet is an instrument. So if God, if God gives someone an instruction, even if it's a utility of Allah, exactly. So therefore, you cannot say, oh, you don't believe God will have a problem with wiping out life because He's already shown it in the flood and in Sodom and Gomorrah because God is the author, the creator and the finisher of life. So if he takes your life by a fly hitting your head or a stone hitting your head or someone being instructed to kill you by a sword, God, because death does not happen without Jesus God's permission. So it doesn't matter the method. And this is why I'm saying this is act of kufr. For you to say act of kufr. Kufr. Ah. To I'm go just helping you when yeah. you refute other Muslims. To, especially when I read the hadith. But I'm going to help them to refute you. To, to, when I read the Shout hadith about your prophet <coughs> saying don't deny or reject. And going on to the Samuel thing, it's yeah. a case of Muslims, I mean Jews, and yeah. it's not me going on a tangent, were not given Islam. They were given the Mosaic laws, their own instructions at that time. Why was there an time. order to smite the Amalekites? Yes. Yeah, re and by the way, by the way, I, I, I firmly believe, but, just like any human who's sensible point. enough... Let me finish my point. Why so should you finish your I'm point just, when I didn't finish all my I'm gonna say no, is Now you're talking to... All, no, no, now no, I'm taking over, sorry. No, no all I'm going to say is So basic one, no, no, not all you're going to say. Now, now you're trolling. Now you're trolling. That is a very simple point to understand. That's it, yeah. Good. Now look, check this. We believe, we believe that Allah is the most merciful. Okay. God is the most merciful. Fine? Fine. So where is the mercy in a God that says... He orders yeah. through the prophets, as you said, yeah. the utilities. Okay. He orders to kill not only the men, okay. but the women. Okay. Yeah. Children. Children. Okay. Suckling. Okay. And then you know the donkey sperm that's, that's in your he, he kills the donkey as well. Okay. That made the sperm. So where was the so, mercy so, during the flood on, and Sodom and Gomorrah? Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. Right. Slow down. I'm gonna come with you. Okay. Firstly, the, Show me the mercy. The, the parables mm. that are in our books and our scriptures mm. were there mm. for our understanding. Why? Okay. Because Allah, mm. our Lord, is so merciful to us mm. that He's actually made these things happen in history for us to take heed. Yes? Our brains only have a certain amount so of... So are you saying Why there you wasn't... Listen, no, I will walk away. I'm trying to and you can say I'm running away. No, no, I'm, because no, 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 I'm just trying to understand stop. what you're saying. You have to stop. I'm trying to understand what you're saying. So don't go off on a tangent. No, I'm trying to say... Ask me in a few words yeah. and let me get back. That's what I'm going to do. So I'm saying, are you saying during the time of the flood and Sodom and Gomorrah, there was no mercy because for people to see later on the consequences are going against God? Is that what you're saying? No. I can go through the whole story of Sodom and Gomorrah for you. Okay. I don't think I'm going to do it justice right now because i got a brother who's hungry. I actually came here to eat. Wallahi, the only reason why I approached yeah. you because you turned to another guy. Yeah, but I, I didn't asked like you a simple trolling. question. I, thought, no, I, I asked him a simple question. Blood, I, there was no I asked a simple babies? question. One at a time. Exactly. One at a time. He's asked me I said, blood. where was one the mercy? One at a time. One at a time. One at a time. One at a time. You or him? Listen. I've spoken to you. And you left in a very, very upset state. Maybe okay. you've come back to me for round two. Okay, I know you don't remember, but okay. your brain has just closed out. on, on, on the mercy. Let's close on one thing. No, the on the mercy. You know answer what? that. I think no, no. there was no Answer the mercy think, bit. I think. Oh, the hold mercy on, hold bit. on. I'll get to the mercy for you, inshallah. Right. Okay. Allah is the most merciful. Okay. Yes. No one. During no Sodom and Gomorrah and no the flood. No one. Hold on. Please be specific. From the creation of. From the creation mm. of the universe yes. till Yom Al Qiyamah, till the day of judgment, Allah is the most merciful. Yeah. And how does he? How will he show us this? Yeah. Allah will not even allow the prophet into paradise except by his Can mercy. You tell me, now, show me people, where. You see, he's yeah. not if answering the are, question. Hold on. You I know said, what? where was the mercy if during these, the flood and if, Sodom right. and Gomorrah? Let me talk about Simple. your prophets. Don't tell me about let me talk resurrection about your prophets. day. 
Don't talk about you my You want me to open the whole story of fundamental I'm moral? I'm saying to you. Do you know you, his prophecy was about? According to the Quran, where was the mercy during the flood and Sodom and Gomorrah? That's all I want to answer. In order, in order for me to give you a satisfactory answer regarding mm. Sodom and Gomorrah, I need to open up more than just one point. I need to open up. You see. I need to. No. You see. You see. You don't know what I'm yeah. going to say. Okay, open, open, you open, don't open, know open, what I'm going to say, open, paper boy. Yeah. Carry on. Go on. First, I'm going to have to mention Ibrahim alayhi salam. He's got a relevance in this story. His family member, Lot alayhi salam. I'm going to have to speak to you about Jibril alayhi salam. I'm going to have to speak to you about Mikael alayhi salam. I'm going to have to speak to you about Israfil alayhi salam. I'm going to have to speak to you about the children of Lot alayhi salam, including their daughters, including his wife. Mm. I'm going to have to speak to you about the ones Allah Ta'ala saved mm -hmm. and the ones he destroyed. Mm -hmm. I need to go through it all, bro. I told you, all right, so no you're going about. to, let's be Mem realistic here. Yeah. yeah? yeah. We what happened started, to babies? We, started, we know about Lot exactly. and his wife and daughters. Ezekiel what 23, happened to 20? babies and don't you talk to me like that? Ezekiel 23, you them. Because you you you're them. saying you had no problem the with you the young them. children and the women that were destroyed during the flood and right. Sodom and watch Gomorrah. This, watch this. Do you know, watch this. Yeah. Oh, check this out. Yeah. Yeah. You know you just said yeah. something shake here. Yeah? Check this out. We don't want another woman and Lot. Can you answer this? Check this out. Check this out. Check this out. Check this out. You said getting to your point. Now you're not going to be able to get with this. Are you alright? Okay. Yeah, yeah, good. Um, you know what the mercy is from Allah that yeah, they don't have? Check this out. You see what he just said about Sodom and Gomorrah and everything, and you're going to try and justify the, uh, the Amalekites and whatever. Don't divert, just stick to yeah, the Quran. Just stick to it. You know what the laws of jihad are? The laws of jihad, I'm when you go out, hold on, no, 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 uh, yeah. look at the mercy of Allah. You see? Yeah, look He's at talking the about mercy jihad Allah. now. I asked you about the time of okay. Moses. Well, He's you see? Very I said Islam was not even. Dishonest. No, you're being intellectually dishonest. dishonest. I said to you, 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 know, you, you, know, you point as hard as you want, no, you know why you're being intellectually dishonest? Because you're going to say, you're going to say, you're in jihad. No, you see? They can't answer the question. Because what he's going to say is that. Allah says, I'm going to say anyway. You see? In All right. I the asked him, him. Yeah. Tell me about the time of Moses the killing of animals. Tell me about the time of, of yeah. Noah Diversion You see it's a rap I told you Islam was not given to Moses I told you Why did Allah You know what Embarrassing If you like It's alright it's alright All that at home is fine You yourself If you like Yes. We can come prepared. We can talk about. So you're saying you are not prepared. prepared. All I wanted was a simple answer. When I say answer. we, it's for you not to feel bad. I'm because feeling bad for you. I asked right. you a simple question. Where Listen. was the mercy during the time yeah, of Noah and Sodom and Gomorrah? Yeah. Yeah. You went to jihad. Why did you go that to that? Why I you said, couldn't answer that. principles. Because I said to you, you couldn't answer principles. Because I said to you, Allah is the same God Paper of boy. Moses. Paper it's the same God. Let's be real. Let's be real. It's the same God of Moses and Noah. And I wait. Let me finish my point. I said to you. Islam was not given to the Jews. They had different rulings. So you have to then show me the mercy of Allah during the time of the floods and Sodom and Gomorrah. Don't tell me about jihad. Let's for argument's sake say Allah is merciful in jihad. That's not my argument. That's a straw, po straw man. I'm saying during that time of those prophets, what was the rulings of Allah to them? Because if you have a problem with uh, 1 Samuel 15, we then have to look at how Allah was acting during those times, not with Muslims. Let's say for argument's sake, Allah has said, don't kill children, don't kill women during jihad. But jihad, those rulings weren't given to Moses. So we have to look at what was the rulings given to Moses. I'm going to let you finish so you don't interrupt me when yes. I Yes. Don't right. interrupt me when I finish. All right. Say. But if you stay on topic, don't, don't mention me Islam, me. but stick to my dad. that time. You're not my dad. Don't interrupt me when I talk. I'm, I've let you that, finish. Yeah, talk. that's fine. So but don't interrupt me when I talk. That's fine. Unless you're finished. I'm, if you're not finished, talk. I'm going to wrap, wrap up. Please you're don't over talk up. me. I won't. Okay. I won't. So because you're talking, you're, 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 you're over talking no, me now. All right. So I'm saying, I'm going to throw the question back to you, but please stick not to anything that Muhammad has said applying to the uh, Muslims or Islam. I'm saying please refer to the times of Noah and the times of Sodom and Gomorrah. What happened to the, the mercy for the women and the children and all the animals okay. so, and the donkeys. Okay. Now, inshallah, I'm going to give my finishing statement. Yes. Yeah? Firstly, I'm not going to open more questions. And the reason why that is because we didn't even accept what we said we would do first before we asked each other questions, is to establish principles. The principle that I established already, you did not establish. Furthermore, you didn't even establish a principle upon yourself where I did. 
Now I will put a disclaimer here. I do solemnly believe, yeah, that even if, even if, uh, supposing I outwitted you in your own scripture, which I feel I did today, but even if it wasn't the case, or it was the case, it doesn't change the scripture that came back that we're speaking about. Because we, you and I, have been here a lot little, a lot less time than the scriptures have been here, and that people before you and I have been speaking about the scriptures. So I would never ever go to judge the scripture based upon you. All that I can do is speak about the scripture itself. But my disclaimer that I put down there, paper boy, I said every Muslim must believe in all of the prophets that came before Muhammad sallallahu and including the books. With the disclaimer, the books say Jesus is the son of God. Gotcha. In school, did they tell you that you'll get the answer if you listen? You have two ears. You have two ears. You have two ears and one mouth. Use them by their number. No, no, no. Christians and Muslims get along. All right, cool. I can't why? take you serious. Why can you? Why are you judging me on well, my face? You're, you're just as bad. Right. If you are not consistent, no, no, no. yeah, do your right. I'm racist against you. Make, make your conclusion. Then you don't we can die. Right, cool. So what I would say, I, I agree with you. We must, we must establish principles. The reason why I went on to speak about the Amalekites is ironic, because when it comes to mercy about Allah, yeah, if I was to play your tactics, I will be coming back to the Bible. I can't. I don't have the ability. I know a lot of you don't. I can't. Right, do it up there. We can speak about Jesus and the Canaanite woman. We can speak about the Amalekites. We can can speak we stick about to all the top? I asked you specifically. I'm not going on to Stick to Hello. Sodom and Gomorrah. All right, let's I just conclude because you're not answering my question. No, no, let's just wrap up. Let's wrap up because you didn't ask. I asked. Let me finish my sentence. All right, let me finish my sentence. Because yeah? okay. it seems like we're not going to get to. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll wrap up. Someone wants to ask you a question. I look. I feel like you're going to possess me. I'm not saying it's one of my original. When you answer the question, could you just? Tell me your religion. Yeah. When you can I can I get can I can I can I get which answer? Can I get can I get hold on hold on yeah. Can I get two two chicken burgers two large fries? Thank you. Straight to heart because I'm losing my voice. Thanks a lot. Can you answer? I'm sure we can wrap up next week. Yeah, but you know we can. We can wrap up. Did he did Mo Hattawi answer my question? Thank you. One thing I will say, it is, it is a flaw in itself to try and justify the verses that I gave you. Because you're justifying something that you would never speak to your daughter about. You don't look like a bad person to me, but Allah knows best, innit? Yeah? God knows best. Yeah? I know that you're... Sometimes when I first came to the park, yeah? And by the way, our debate's gone now, finish, yeah? When I first came here, someone put a question on me. It was a Christian missionary. Yeah? And he goes to me, do you believe your God is the all-powerful and the all-able? I said, yes. He said, okay, and ironically, he's asking me this question. It should be coming from an atheist, but I think he just found like fresh meat to play with because he probably knew I never knew my stuff at the time. And he goes to me, all right, cool. So Allah is all able. Is there anything Allah can't do? I said, no, can't doesn't exist with Allah. He said, all right, cool. He said, can Allah create a stone, a rock he can't lift? Mm -hmm. Now I went home really upset that day. I didn't want to come back. Yeah, I thought I'm not doing uh, any, fa any favors to the verses that I'm trying to defend here which is in the Quran. And then I thought to myself, SubhanAllah, there are many ways that we can angle things. But if we speak objectively and honestly, intellectually honestly with ourselves about mm. a certain text, decipher it, break it down, derive from it the correct connotations. But we have to base it upon what? Is it our own logic? No. We have to base it upon some sort of commonality and principle, mm -hmm. which you and I haven't been able to do today. That's why my voice is gone, your voice is gone. Yeah, we've got... Teenage Mutant Ninja Tail over here as well. I don't know what's going on right now. Yeah, it's all mad. We've gone to ad hominems. We've gone to all sorts of. I things, didn't yeah? go to ad no. hominems. You did. No. I asked. You did. I asked it's you a fine. specific it's fine. question. I'm, I'm thicker skin than I that. asked you it's a specific fine. question to answer me about the mercy in the flood and Sodom and Gomorrah, and you failed to answer it I adequately. Think, you know, I think, paper boy. I think you and I know that both of us can have a good answer. conversation. Yeah. 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 I, I believe yeah. that you and I can possibly have a very good conversation. But if we you answer to, my questions but, and inshallah, come but, prepared next week. But, I actually didn't want to come to talk. I came to eat and look, now they're waiting for me. Okay. And I was outside so, waiting for them. Yeah, we can <laughs> I, said, I was in the car waiting for them. I was like, come on, man. Well, I don't know if there's free parking here. Because I've, why and then I came in, they're waiting for me. And, you and, like, and I also gave you the hadith for your That's prophet, why I had to make an order on the phone with them. Uh, <laughs> he said you shouldn't believe or disbelieve. Oh, yeah. All you're supposed to say as a Muslim is yeah. we believe in the Quran, we believe in one God and the prophets that sent him. So when you actually attack the Bible and say, I don't believe God will say this or that, you're actually going against your own belief because we can bring hadiths where your prophet says you shouldn't do those sorts 
sort of thing. Perfect. Even when Umar was reading the Quran and the, the Torah, Muhammad took it from him and said, "You're not. Why are you reading it?" So all these Muslims reading the the the, 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 the Torah and the Bible to attack it, then you're not following the Sahaba. Yeah. The way, the way, the way of giving da'wah, the way of giving da'wah, unfortunately not many people, not a lot of people do it, yeah? The way to give da'wah is to call away from one thing and to call towards something else. To call away from false gods yes. and to talk about one God yeah. and to call towards Allah. Unfortunately, Speaker's Corner now has become a place that is people's, not only is people's claim to fame, Agents have been put here. <coughs> you and I both know that. Spies have been put here. And Everyone knows. There's that. terrorists here. We know that. All right. Then we have to define a terrorist. But there's terrorists. Convicted in terrorists. There's terrorists in every Con group. Convicted. So there's terrorists that are not found as well. Are you saying that? I'm just saying there's, there's terrorists convicted. in every group, right? Let's not forget the convicted terrorists. Let's not go into them. Let's not go into it. What I'm saying. What's Bob? Yeah. Don't 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 yeah. So, yeah. But on this, let's let's wrap up anyway. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So all I'm saying, I believe that a construct Constructive conversation, yeah, is between with objectives and with principles established. These two fences are the parameters in which we speak with our interlocutor. When I came, I had someone bringing Bible to you. You were bringing Quran, sorry. You were bringing Quran and Hadith to them. You're never going to get to an accomplishment. All you're going to do is get hits on a YouTube video, and no one's really like much. There has to be an objective, and there has to be principles established. So when you try to reach the objective, if you metaphorically pull me back, I can land on my principle again and say, all right, let me, let me start again. Unfortunately, in the park now, it's a lot more than that. A lot of ego gets involved. I get involved with ego as well sometimes. Sometimes I think someone's trying to chuck it with me. So then I, I try, my ego comes forward and uh, the da'wah sets backwards. And we're all men. All of us can get involved in stuff like that. All of us. Twiddle Dumb's looking hungry. Look at that man. <laughs> 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 you're not hungry. Look at that. Allah, 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 you're hungry as well. Allah, Allah, Allah. I'm sure you're hungry as well. This guy is on a gay website. You're on a gay website. You need 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 <laughs> There's a time God permits us he to speak to you. Let's have two things established first. Let's have objectives. Let's have objectives. Let's have objectives. Let's have objectives. Let's have Let's have objectives. Let's have objectives. Let's Let's have objectives. 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 Let's have Anyway, just to conclude, just, just, just to conclude, inshallah, yeah? yeah, yeah. Just to, just to come. Where was the merchant? Give your answer. Right. Right. If you don't have an answer, just, just be honest. Just to come. <laughs> Alright, come stand with me if it makes you feel better. Come, come, come. Just, 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 just to conclude, inshallah. Yeah. Any time a discussion yeah, goes on, there has to be objectives and there has to be principles established. I know you agree with me. Yeah? So if we're going to have a discussion again, inshallah, let's do it upon objectives and principles. If you start talking about me or I start talking about you, we're not doing any justice at all to our religions. All we can, all we, all, 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 all we can extrapolate is the text in the book. Would you agree with that? Yes. Should we leave it on that? Your eternity. Uh, until next week. Until, until week. next time I'm here. Whenever until next I'm time. Whenever I'm here, you can answer my question. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why are you can I have a discussion? Can I have a discussion with you? Yes, Alright, I'm gonna start a discussion with him right now, yeah? No, 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 I'm gonna start a discussion with you right now. I'm gonna start a No, 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 it's fine, you've got enough battery. I'm gonna start a discussion with you right now. He wants an answer to my question. What's the most important thing for you right now? I'm gonna give you Shall I give you my answer? Yes. Food, I'm going to eat. Take care, yeah? Bye bye! Next please! Okay. Next please! You see, you lost right, cool. it was a Great, cool. about exposing and unwrapping the Islamic polemic against the Bible. But then even the prophet has clearly said, oh, I, I, keep reading, I keep reading, oh, home, I keep reading. This Tweedle D. Oh, no, no, no. Tweedle D. <laughs> You're not going to have the last one. Hey, oh, no, no. the immigrations are looking for you. You got a do now, clearly we see <laughs> this person's <laughs> Dean has failed him. Oh.
His oh, team no. has failed him. All right, cool, cool, cool. Your food is waiting. <laughs> go and get your shawarma. Run. <laughs> now, right, we clearly see yeah. the hypocrisy of their arguments. Yeah. First, he tried to go to Ezekiel, and we tried to. I tried to tell him it's actually a metaphorical uh, verse. But then he didn't. Want, he tried to pretend that he didn't hear my answer. I didn't give an answer. I gave it many, many times. Yeah. And then when what they try and do is, is attack verses in the Bible and say First Samuel or Ezekiel. But even as Muslims, they're not supposed. One, they have no criteria of determining what is corrupted or uncorrupted. Fair enough, if there's something in the Quran which goes against the Bible, they might say, we take the Quran. But the Quran doesn't mention 1 Samuel 15 or Ezekiel. Neither did the Sahaba, nor did the Prophet. The Quran doesn't say, I did not say this verse. But so clearly we have to see with the Islamic argument is that they cherry pick. And then that's why I asked him. Yeah. And I specifically started by saying, don't tell me about what Islam says. But tell me what Allah yeah. told yeah. Moses yeah. and Noah and all the prophets in yeah. the Old Testament. What were the instructions for them? Then he tried to go to jihad. <laughs> and this clearly highlights that they do not have a leg to stand on. Firstly, how can you build how can you build your religion on how can you build your faith on a religion that rejects the the, the Old Testament and the Gospels? Yeah. It's rejecting Jewish history. So it's just like a Pick and, pick and mix pick and religion and, yeah. it's not based on any foundation Nothing. and this is why when we ask them these questions they're rejecting things that are clearly have been established for many years and even the Sahaba Prophet Muhammad none of them had any issue with all these verses he couldn't even tell me about the mercy during the floods or mm. Sodom and Gomorrah but yet he'll say um, you know the women and children were killed but we asked him many times so where was the mercy from Allah he couldn't answer it and again this is why we expose the Islamic argument and it's very basic and you know people just need to become a bit more learned because when you apply the same arguments to Islam that they try and apply to the Bible or Christianity Islam falls flat and that's why you couldn't even answer those basic questions and if you watch from the whole discussion he couldn't answer my questions he kept diverting sophistry waffling yeah. about nothing i asked him to prove yeah. how he dis distinguished between corruption and non-corruption in the bible yeah he said let's start with you believe god is above all creation yeah. that's not answering my question nothing, nothing, nothing. so clearly we see Wait, and, and chips. well that's it and, <laughs> it and this is the same muhammad tawhi that was sending pictures of his appendage oh. to innocent muslim women <laughs> and to have a cheek to talk about he would, <laughs> would never say what happened to babies and donkeys exactly. in the town of Sodom and Gomorrah nothing, nothing. in okay. the time of Noah's flood yeah. exposing the hypocrisy so, so, thank you thank you family <laughs>